ప్రైజ్ ద లాడ్ వర్స్ ఆఫ్ ద డే లూక్ చాప్టర్ ఫిఫ్టీన్ వర్స్ ట్వంటీ అండ్ హీ అరోస్ అండ్ కేమ్ టు హిస్ ఫాదర్ బట్ వెన్ హీ వాస్ స్టిల్ ఎ గ్రేట్ వే ఆఫ్ హిస్ ఫాదర్ సా హిమ్ అండ్ హ్యాడ్ కంపాషన్ అండ్ ర్యాన్ అండ్ ఫెల్ ఆన్ హిస్ నెక్ అండ్ కిస్ టు హిమ్ హియర్ ఇన్ దిస్ పర్టిక్యులర్ చాప్టర్ మీన్స్ లూక్ ఫిఫ్టీన్ వీ కెన్ అబ్జర్వ్ ద లాస్ట్ షిప్ ద లాస్ కాయిన్ అండ్ ద లాస్ సన్ మీన్స్ ద ప్రోడిగల్ సన్ టుడే we are going to discuss about the prodigal son a certain man had two sons and the anger of them said to his father father give me the portion of goods that falls to me so his father divided his property to them means his livelihood and here we can observe one thing that this prodigal son means the lost son he gave most priority to the portion of goods which will falls to him which will come under to him but he didn't give much priority to his father he forgotten him sometimes we can observe this thing in the, in our christian life too most of the christians they will focus on the things means the blessings or uh, the property and um, the cars the bungalows and all but they'll forgot they'll forget the god from whom we are getting all these things this is a saddest thing that we need to change most of the time we'll give priority to the things but not to the god from from whom we are getting all these things and when he this prodigal son when he got his property and he spent all this all his property in a prodigal way and where he was living in that particular country there is a severe famine there is no food to eat then he went and joined himself to a citizen of that country who would gladly have filled his stomach with the pots that swine ate and no one gave him anything so he wanted to eat the food which the swines will eat the sw- and then he came to realize himself that there are the servants in his father's home who have enough sufficient food to eat so he decided he will go and ask confess his sin before his father like father i have sinned before you and to the heaven also so from this verse from this saying from this particular word we can observe that this prodigal son this lost son he know about god that's why only he included the word i sin against to you and against to the heaven also but he lost his relationship with his father so in the same way we sometimes no we knew the bible very well we knew uh, we knew how to pray but still sometimes we lost our relationship with our god our intimacy relationship with god because that because of so many reasons because of we will give more priority to the humans or to the things to the money like that we we'll lost our relationship so today our god want us to reconcile with him we can reconcile our relationship with him and when when we are in lost son stage in his position what will happen what our father is doing we can see this in second uh, means in 20th verse that when he was still far away from when he was still far away while he was coming his father he saw him and he ran to him and he had a compassion and he ran and fell on his neck and kissed him here we can observe that his father is waiting for him though he went off and maybe the time also tough but still his father is waiting for him in the same way a god also when we are in loss and position a god also waiting for us to reconcile our relationship with him so let us reconcile our relationship with him let us pray dear god thank you lord you have spoken with us through this prodigal son's passage i give thanks to you enable us to reconcile with you in jesus name i pray.